Hey, taking a look outside. Look at outside right now. It doesn't look like December just yet. It doesn't feel like December. It's 50 no. degrees. Hopefully Santa does bring a truck because <laughs> he's not getting anywhere in the snow. Maybe the ice. Let's bring in Storm Track 8 meteorologist <laughs> Tara Hastings. Tara, big changes on the way here. Yeah, we're going to see some tumbling temperatures and also pretty windy conditions heading into the night tonight. So that's something we have to watch. We do not have a wind advisory in effect for the metro area, but we do have a wind advisory just off to the west of us. That's where we're seeing uh, some winds a little bit more stronger around Terre Haute, also into Lafayette and into parts of South Bend and moving into parts of Illinois. These are some of the wind gusts that we've been seeing so far. Wind speeds right now gusting up to 24 miles per hour in Indianapolis, right around 25 in Shelbyville. And we have a wind gust in Lafayette up to 36 miles per hour. So a windy evening expected across much of central Indiana, but we will eventually uh, see some improvements. And we're picking up some rain too. Uh, on Storm Tracker, we have a, a little bit of some light shower activity moving across parts of Marion County. We'll go a little bit farther southward, and that's where we're seeing uh, some more moderate rain here moving into parts of Columbus, see more over towards Bedford. Uh, the wider view shows that here we have that line of rain moving through. This rain will continue for the next several hours. And once colder air moves in, we may briefly change over to a little bit of snow later tonight, but I am not anticipating uh, any kind of accumulation at all. Mostly cloudy skies out there right now. 50 degrees in Indianapolis where we do have that rain and winds are out of the south at about 16 miles per hour sustained. Future cast shows cloudy conditions this evening. Here's 10 o'clock. Another round of some light rain that will move through as that cold front gets a little bit closer to us and about 1, 2 o'clock in the morning colder air will move in. So again, we're going to briefly change over to snow in some spots, but look at this. It quickly moves off to the east of Indianapolis by about 3, 4 o'clock in the morning. And then much of the precipitation is off to the east of us working into parts of Ohio. So we'll see with mostly cloudy skies heading into your Thursday, it is going to be a cold and breezy day heading into the afternoon on Christmas Eve. Forecasted temperatures tomorrow. This has been one of those days where our highs will occur right after midnight. And we're going to see those temperatures fall into the 20s for the afternoon. By 5 o'clock tomorrow, we're only going to see temperatures right around 23 degrees and that's just without the winds factoring in either. We have this cold air mass that is going to move in for Christmas. We're talking about wind chill values heading into Christmas morning, likely below zero. Look at this, sub-zero wind chills heading into Friday morning and highs on Friday. Well, they're going to be staying in the upper teens close to 20. In your Chapman heating and cooling, eight-day forecast. 20 degrees on Friday. That's it. We'll warm up a little bit on Saturday with some sunshine highs near 36. Lower 40s on Sunday with a chance for a few showers and a pretty active week next week with temperatures in the upper 30s right around 40.